And we're back, guys. Welcome to Tennis in a Minute. I'm your host, Good Energy. Yana Fett, ranked 266 in the world, taking on the 26th ranked player, Martina Trevor 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 San Ciao Bella, the number one ranked Italian on tour right now. Now, listen, Martina's she's having a losing season. That's right. She's 10 and 12. She's having a losing season, but she's won six of her last 10 matches, and her losses have come to elite competition beecher sadad elena rabike and amukova and big game jesse p she's playing the best of the best and she's a seven to one favorite in this match now yana fett i mean her high ranking is 97th but she hangs around with ballers now listen guys if your friends your closest friends are some of the best players on tour you're going to be a pretty good player, right? Practicing, playing with them, talking tennis, learning, feeding off of each other. Yana Fett, she's a lot better than her ranking. So the 7-1 favorite, in my opinion, I think it's purely rankings-based. And this is where things get a little kind of, you know, you have to be alert because Yana Fett has already played three matches on this court. She's accustomed to the court. She's used to the court. And if you follow this channel, and if you have been following this channel, what do I say all the time? You have to watch out for huge favorites going up against good competition that, sh that has struggled but is playing decent at the moment. Yana's won seven of her last ten and has come through qualifiers and had a chance to warm up on the courts. That's where most upsets happen in tennis, that the early tournament stages where you have a qualifier that's clicking and they're playing someone that's been struggling and hasn't got used to the course. Now, Naomi Osaka said last year in Miami, she said, um, I kind of like having to play the extra match because I get a chance to, you know, Naomi's voice, Naomi Osaka's voice, you know, I kind of like it. But listen, guys, Martina Travisan, we all know what she wants to do. I say it all the time. Uh, Mid-range game is amazing. He, she can come cross court. She can play the net, the short ball. She's going to put them away. She'll get in trouble trying to baseline with Yana Fett. I think Yana Fett's going to win a lot more of those exchanges. But then again, Yana Fett's also athletic. She can chase down those balls too. Uh, I don't think Martina should be a 7-1 favorite. I said it yesterday. I said it in the videos today. This is a match I'm watching closely. I'm your host, Good Energy tennis in a minute we are here the rolling Garros is here baby get your popcorn good energy we'll be predicting every single round for free and of course if you want my best picks you're gonna have to donate for that be generous to the super thanks see you soon